need that secret. <laughs> what's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Man, what's what's going on? Hold on, let me get my house shoes because I don't like being barefooted on anybody. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> how y'all doing? First of all, what's what's what's, what's going on with y'all? have a conversation <laughs> in the spirit so when I actually was what's going on what's happening it could be quite literally literal right ain't that crazy it's crazy but anyway I hope you're doing all right I know y'all doing all right because I'm doing all right <laughs> so okay I got I got I got some for you Matthew Hold up. Father God, thank you for this day, Lord. Thank you for your peace, your mercy, your grace, your joy. Father God, your peace will surpass all understanding. Lord God, let me decrease while you increase in me fully. And let the words that come up with my lips be that of your Holy Spirit. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. So. Sorry, I was reading some uh, side stuff. So Matthew 14, right? 19 and 20, okay? And he commanded the multitude to sit down on the grass and took the five loaves and the two fishes and looking up to heaven, he blessed and break and gave the loaves to his disciples and the disciples to the multitude and they did all eat and were filled. I love this scripture right here. Because it explains the birthing process. <laughs> if you have eyes to see and ears to hear, okay. It explains the birthing process, right? It explains what we just went through, right? I mean, what we'll constantly be going through until we're done with our purpose here, right? But if you pay close attention, you can dissect it, okay? Check this out. And he commanded the multitude, this is Jesus, he commanded the multitude to sit down on the grass, okay? We lie down in green pastures. <laughs> Get it? Yeah. Okay. And took the five loaves and the two fishes. And looking up to heaven, he blessed and break and gave the loaves to his disciples. He blessed and break and gave the loaves to his disciples. And the disciples to the multitude, and they did all eat and were filled. So this is literally, I was about to try to break, go on to this uh, 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 long description, but it doesn't need it. It doesn't need it at all, okay? This is mirroring, okay? Thank you, Holy Spirit. The Lord has been breaking us, okay? He's been breaking us, okay? And feeding us, right? Breaking us, feeding us, breaking us feeding us, okay? And gave the loaves to his disciples and the disciples to the multitude. We are 
the loaves. We are the loaf. We are the loaf. Which he gave. Do you get it? I hope you get it. Like, I, I'm... Tra it, 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 it don't need no description. <laughs> One more time. Matthew 14, 19 and 20. He commanded the multitude to sit down on the grass and took the five loaves and the two fishes and looking up to heaven, he blessed and he break like, Jason, like Jacob wrestling with an angel and gave the loaves to his disciples and the disciples to the multitude. We are about to step into something. Thank you, Holy Spirit. <laughs> Holy Spirit, leave me hanging here for a second. <laughs> we are about to step into a place that you have, that we could never have even fathomed, okay? We're about to step into a place where God is going to give us way more than we asked for. Stuff that wasn't even on our mental. Got me? He's going to bless us in a way that we have not experienced thus far. In so much as the world is going to witness it. Remember that vision I gave uh, maybe a couple months ago about uh, God preparing a table in front of you know the presence of our enemies, and our enemies had to sit and watch, strapped to the chair, with a with a their mouth covered, couldn't move, couldn't go high, couldn't go slander and lie, couldn't do none of the stuff that they usually do. Right? I'm talking to you. I'm pretty sure you're watching too. You're the first one who watches my videos every time I post. Yeah, I knew that. When will you learn? Uh, uh, apparently never. Okay? But yes, I know. I know. I know you wait. I know. That's got to be exhausting. That's got to be exhausting to be such a busybody in other grown men's business okay I'm surprised that you even held the job or held anything that you have oh oh wait 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 I forgot well that you're losing or that you've lost already because that's going away but maybe that's why that's going away because you took you spent all of your time focused on me and my business grown men, supposedly, focused on me and my business, right? The chosen one's business, when y'all could have been doing your own business. But instead, y'all wanna watch us like, 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 like a, <laughs> like a drive-in movie, movie screen. Uh, and that's, that's fine, I guess. I mean, but you're only making yourself mad. You're only making yourself mad. Do you know how bad you make yourself look? Every time you get pissed off <laughs> from us not being upset, for you not being able to draw off of some negative energy that you're trying to cause us to have. This is the foolishness and the wickedness of man. You've been trying this whole time and you failed. You have failed. And there's been a group of you at different times too. You've gotten, you've had me specifically, in my situation, you've had two years ahead and I didn't even know for a while. You had two years ahead and you still couldn't beat me. None of y'all, you still couldn't beat me. So you still trying, thinking that there's something you can pull out of, there's a rabbit you can pull out of a hat This is the burial ground. This is the burial ground. <laughs> this is the burial ground. Since you want to watch it so much, now you'll be looking up like this.
and for the rest of your life, you will regret every wicked and demonic and disgusting thing that you have done for the rest of your life. For the rest of your life, you'll be miserable. Miserable. But by nobody, but by nobody's actions but your own. You can't even, you can't blame anybody else. I didn't do nothing to you in the first place. Every chosen one of God did not do anything to you in the first place. You just decided to try to come and steal, kill, and destroy. You did for a while. You did for a little bit. But oh, how the tables turn. Oh, how the tables turn. 11-11 on my timer. Oh, how the tables turn. I'll tell you once again, you know my favorite line that David said? My favorite line. So much as that. Every time I read it, I can literally see David. King David, I can, my ancestor, right? I can even see King David with the look that he might have had on his face. Talking to Goliath, this big old giant. And David's like this big. <laughs> David's like, who is this uncircumcised Philistine defying the armies of the living God? You're no different. You are no different. <laughs> yeah, I feel your anger. I do, I do. You should go get that checked out. You should go get help for that. You know? It's kind of dark. All it's going to do is consume you and take you out. I mean, you're doing that pretty well already. So I just came up here to encourage my brothers and sisters right quick and uh, let you guys know that I'm still here kicking. Because you've been wondering. No, I'm not arrogant. No, I ain't cocky. I ain't prideful. That would be you. Mr. Slanderers. Mouths full of bile. Shh. Yeah, that. Just full of it. But, you know, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay, Smokey. It's okay, Smokey. Yeah, let me get up out of here. I gotta eat, and I'm tired of playing with these things. Okay. Anyway. Y'all, okay? <laughs> be waiting, okay? Be in expectance. And, and be expecting, thank you, <laughs> of what's coming, okay? Because it's coming. Alright? Alright. I love y'all. Peace. <laughs> what is the. Uh, okay, that's something like that. There's a hole in my head.